Okay, I'm going to go back to the phones here. I will uh, delay the next set of promised sound bites. I'm going to defer them for later on in the program. Because I just realized I've only taken one call. It's open line Friday. I need to do better. So we'll head out of Nashville. It's Bryce. And I'm glad you waited. How you doing, sir? Mega dittos, Rush. It's an honor to be talking to you. Thank you, sir. My question is, if, we're, if the pre-election polls and the exit polls are wrong, why do we believe the popularity polls of Obama? What was the sampling? Well, it's you're talking about his approval numbers? Yes. Here's one theory. When you put Obama's policies and his agenda on a poll, or you ask if people think the country's headed in the wrong direction or the right direction, there's no question. Wrong direction, two-thirds people say so. And almost as many people oppose the Obama agenda. But then when you ask a separate question, and maybe even a separate poll, how would you rate President Obama in his job performance? He gets 53%. Now, my theory is that if everything's legit, that that result is come by because people refuse to tell a pollster they disapprove of Obama because of the racial component. They simply don't want the pollster to think that they're racist. If it's not legit, then the pollsters are making it up. Because it doesn't it doesn't fit. I mean, how do you have a president with a 53% approval rating when two-thirds of the people disapprove of everything he's done? And that's, exactly. your, that's your question, right? Yes, exactly. And most people I know can't wait for next Friday. Uh, yeah, I know. I know. But if the question... Look, everybody knows he's leaving anyway. So if it's just a question, how would you rate president approval job performance? Many people think it's a likability poll and say, hey, he's a likable guy. I don't dislike him. He's dead wrong on everything. But, um, but look, if you are suspicious that the poll is not... Right. I'm not going to try to talk you out of it. The evidence is abundant that the polls have been monkeyed with over the course of uh, well, this whole campaign. So if, if it makes more sense to you that the poll is manufactured in order to make Obama look good, I'm not going to try to talk you out of it. I'm just telling you, I can see 53 percent of people in a sample saying they like Obama because they don't want to even get close to saying they don't like the first black president. They just, they, nobody believes in privacy. They think everybody can violate security, find out who they are, people scared to death. And even so, it's only 53. It's not the 66 that Clinton had. Hey, look, I'm out of time. I got to ask you real quick. Snurdly, we'll get the details. If you want a new iPhone 7 or iPhone 7 Plus, tell him. Tell him your carrier and the color you want. I'm going to throw in some of these brand new wireless AirPods that are one of the greatest things Apple's ever made. Back in just a second. Don't go.